third, he's coming. Up to second. First win, yeah. I taped it. Whoa, pretty good. Oh man, how are you hearing? Pretty good. That was a heck of a race. I gotta go down there.
Yeah, he knows you? Yeah. Yeah, you wanna? Yo, Zach, come on. Wanna go down there? I'm traveling from the race car. Give him a round of applause first. Whoa! TJ Thompson. Yeah. TJ, I'll give you a second to unstrap your helmet, your Hans device, all the safety equipment here at Seacom Speedway. What a drive you put in this number 24 car. A, a great battle with the number 12, uh, Brandon Martinez. It was a tight battle up front. But once you got out front, you had to navigate a little bit of lap traffic, and once you were there, you didn't look back, and you could get career victory number one. Uh, I don't even have any words right now. Um, that was an awesome draft. We made huge changes before the race. Uh, i got to thank my dad. I can't thank him enough. We really threw this at it. I really wanted to be able to battle Nick uh, for that win. Um, it sucks that he has mechanical problems or something, but, man, what, uh, what a win. How does it feel to win at a track like Seekonk Speedway? It is awesome. This is easily one of my favorite tracks. It's one of the toughest to drive, actually, and it's just a ton of fun. They're not using any brakes, just rolling on and off the throttle. You're going to feel like you're going 100 miles an hour. What were you feeling as a, in the car as you rolled off across the victory, the, 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 the finish line, for the first time in your career? It took a minute to sink in, I'm not going to lie to you. I was just uh, trying to run really consistent laps those last few and not make any mistakes and keep it straight and bring home victory. Well, TJ, congratulations one more time, ladies and gentlemen. You got him, Mikey! TJ Thompson, first time winner at Seacom Speedway. He's headed up to Everett's Auto Parts Victory Lane. Yay! I just got to say a big thank you to M. Jolly and Sons LLC. They literally put us back on the track. We had a big wreck of Waterford earlier this season, and they've rebuilt this car for us, so I got to thank them a ton. Well, one more time, ladies and gentlemen, TJ Thompson headed up to Everett's Auto Parts Victory Lane. Career victory number one. And a point, TJ. Oh, uh, the car is sizzling down here. Car number 24 set it up to Everett's Auto Parts Victory Lane. First time that car is going to see the Victory Lane, but what a stellar drive that TJ Thompson was able to put forward. Unfortunate for Nick Wascola as his win streak comes to an end at 7, was not able to score win number 8 tonight. But it'll be up tomorrow night, and hopefully the weather is not a factor tomorrow. Feel free to come.